It's Cape Chronicle. I'm Jacob McClellan. Southeast Missouri State University's River Campus will hold the first Summer Arts Festival on June the 21st. The full day event will have all sorts of arts and activities and performances for all ages. I'm joined now by Rhonda Weller Stilson. She's the director of the Holland School of Visual and Performing Arts and the Associate Dean of the College of Liberal Arts. Thank you so much for being here to talk with us. Thank you for having me. So we're going to have dance, performing arts, um, visual arts, all sorts of all sorts of fun stuff at the River Campus. T tell us a, a little bit about some of the the performers that will be uh, that, that and, and the artists that will the folks will be able to see on June twenty first. Sure, absolutely. Well, it's an all day festival. It'll be from ten to five, and there will be continuous entertainment. So outdoors, we'll have a stage set up, and we'll have musicians, everything from the Suzuki Kids up to Jerry Ford Combo. The Southeast Steel Drums, uh, Barefoot on Sunday, it's a folk group, and Mr. Saxophone who does children's music. So that'll be all day long. And then we'll have a magician who'll be roaming and then also do a performance on the stage. And that is Rob Huff. He's a local um, person, so we're very excited to have him. And then we'll have dance during the day. There'll be dance classes that people can take and participate, and then actually watch dance on the Bedell stage. So all types of performances, and uh, high school students will be performing as well in theater and in vocal music. Now, will there be hand, like hands-on activities for kids that want to uh, get their hands dirty with some artwork, yes. or maybe learn how to do, or learn how to dance, or anything like yes. that? Yes, there will be a big tent that'll be outdoors, and it'll have activities for kids. It'll be running all day. It's free, and they'll have like ten activities and ten different art projects they can create. And then they'll also be able to go into the studio and and dance with them in country, western dance, or hip hop, different things. So it'll be a great day for kids. You, br you brought some flyers here for some posters. Show us, sure. uh, show us what you show us this here. Well, we're really thrilled with the design. Louise Bodenheimer, who is one of our professors in the art department, designed it for us, and we're just very excited. Let's see if we can get, if we can get a shot of that. There we go. So admission is free for uh, for this for the first summer arts festival. They said this is the this is the very first time that the River Campus has done yes, something like is. this. Yes, it is. We've been having a lot of people who have been asking for activities during the summer, and so we're happy to be able to make this happen. So. Did, did you see this that kind of as a there was a niche that needed to be to be filled here in Cape Girardeau? Yes, there were festivals in the past that created um, had the visual and the performing arts, but recently they haven't been happening, and so uh, this one will bring all of that back and it is a community arts festival celebrating all of the arts so we're really excited to have it. So will most of the uh, performers, artists, everything like that, will these be folks from uh, from, from here in the, around uh, around this region? There'll be everything from um, little children who are in the music academy or dance studios up to um, older adults who've lived here all their lives. They'll be from Southeast Missouri, South, Southern Illinois, all over. Well, we can't forget to talk about Nonsense. Um, this yes. will be a, a musical that will be performed yes. um, uh, around the same time, correct? Yes, this is also part of the Summer Arts Festival and Nonsense will be directed by Dr. Ken Stilson. It is produced by the Holland School. It's our first production and uh, Judith Ferris will be Mother Superior. We'll have other faculty, students and community members involved as well and it'll open on June the 19th. I, you know, I don't recall there being a, a, a summer performance like this uh, before. Is this, is, this, is, this, is this new? This is new, and we hope that this will become an annual event. And uh, thanks to our sponsors, we're getting it off the ground this summer. And how about um, uh, the River City Players? Will they be involved at all? Yes, they're going to be doing a production called A Bench in the Sun, and they'll be um, in the midday part of the festival. Rhonda Weller Stilson is the director of the Holland School of Visual and Performing Arts and the Associate Dean of the College of Liberal Arts. Thank you so much for coming by to talk with us. Thank you.